Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. So if, if you can, you, if you can tell me what what's happening there. Yeah, sure. So right now we. So this is the vaginal wall. Okay. So coming down the vaginal wall. It's normal and it's a good thing for this number of days. You can see it's kind of all crinkly. That's the mm -hmm. catheter tip. Mm -hmm. Which I think you still need to go a little bit. Is your camera straight? Uh, no. Okay, Good girl. Okay. So has it gone into the cervix yet? No. Yeah, no. no. So we're just getting down into this is the paracervix up here. I'm just going underneath. Actually, I think you need to go under under that, under this thing. There you go. Now we're just coming underneath the cervix. the cervix right now. So that's going into a cervix? Now? Yep. So see the little black lines tell pass through? Uh -huh. yep. yep, tell them to thaw. Okay, and now we just wait. They're going to finish thawing soon. We just, hope that just try to make her as hot as possible for the next couple of minutes. Perfect. So the catheter will actually go into the, into the uterus? Yes. And You'll see when we get out, we'll show you, when we come out, we leave, we don't move the catheter, so mm -hmm. you can see how much was inside yeah. through the cervix and then into the uterus. So, well, we just, because we're not, you know, she's a maiden, a lot of times we try to wait to thaw until we have her catheterized. Mm -hmm. So we don't have the semen sitting around and waiting right. for a long time. So. It, um, so the seam is going to be thawed now? It's being thawed right now. And then they're going to bring it to us. And will and the camera be able to see inside the uterus? No. no. That's all you get to see. Oh, okay. <laughs> so then basically the camera is kind of behind, not at the tip. The ca we can, I can draw you a picture when we get done. But it, the camera is at the end of that scope, which is right now maybe oh not even a centimeter from that the entrance to the cervix right. 